Good dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting this video, I would like to say something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, then note it and proceed further. And although you have facing any problem or difficulties, please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you. Now here is the question. A 750 Hertz 20 volt RMS source is connected to a resistance of 100 ohm and inductance of 0 0.18030 Henry and a capacitance of 10 microfarad all in series. The time in which the resistance heat capacity is given that 2 joule per degree centigrade will get heated by 10 degrees Celsius. Assume no loss of heat to the surroundings is close to here we have given four options option first 245 second option b 365 second option c 418 second and option d 348 second in this question we have given all this information frequency potential resistance inductance capacitance heat capacity important things is the heat capacity is given that 2 joule per degree celsius delta t is the temperature difference okay so therefore we know that very well in this uh, heating effect of current heating effect of current that means heat required or heat produced by the flow of current that is i square rms and r this is the time t for time r for resistance and i rms okay and this energy is equal to by the thermometry or calorimetry rule that is required heat of any substance that is depend on the mass, specific heat and temperature difference. Okay. This is remember this is delta T is the temperature difference and this is the time. Small t is the time and this is the temperature difference. Okay. For our convenience we have written here. By comparing first equation and second equation, ms delta t is equal to i r m s square r t. And we have to find out this time. So here time equal to ms delta t upon i r m s square and r. Remember here heat capacity. We have given that heat capacity 2 joule per degree Celsius. And what is the formula of heat capacity? ms. Ms is called heat capacity. Okay, so this is the heat capacity. So let us first we have to find out the RMS of current. For our convenience, we have to find out first XL. XL is omega L, and what is omega? 2 pi frequency and L. So here 2. A value of pi 3.14 frequency is 750 and L inductance is given that 0 0.1803. Remember in the calculation 3.1 can be considered 3 750 and here very important point because of we have to given that 4 value 4 after the decimal. So therefore we can't be put here 0 0.2. Okay, you can put here 0 0.18 but not 0 0.2 because we have given four digit after decimal. If we have to put 0 0.2, then many changes we have to get and we can't reach on the correct options. So it is very important things. So here 0 0.18 can be substitute here. So XL, here the value of XL is approximately 8. 50 ohm okay and for the xc we know that 1 upon omega c omega c omega can be written as 2 pi and uh, frequency this is the value of omega and the c capacitance is given that 10 micro means 10 raised to power minus c now substitute all this value 2 into 3.14 into 750 and 10 to the power minus 5. After solving this, we will get 21.2 approximate its value. 
okay so here we get 850 ohm and 21.2 ohm xc okay now let us first we have to find out the impedance what is the formula of impedance z equal to root xl minus xc square plus r square now substitute this value what is the value of xl that is 850 21.2 square and r is given 100 ohm okay 21.2 can be considered 21 so here 829 approximate 830 square plus 100 and uh, 830 square means 83 square that is 688920 so here the value is 68 9900 zero, zero. so 20 can be written as 6899 and 6899 is approximately 6900 so here 20 again it become 100 then 69 root 69 again its value is 8.3 so 100 into 8.3 then its value is 830 okay so here the impedance is 830 ohm now the formula i rms equal to v by z 20 by 830 okay and now this value of i rms substitute in this formula t equal to ms heat capacity Right, capacity is given that 2 delta t is given that temperature difference is 10 and i rm square that is 2 by 83 square and 100 so this 0 cancel out 2 and 2 square that is 4 again 83 into 83 and uh, this is 10 okay 2 to the 4 and uh, here that is 20 and 83 square that is 6889 and divided by 20 so 2 3 the 6 2 4 the 8 2 4 the 8 and again 2 4 the 8 and 0.5 divided by 10 so 344 point something that is time a second okay so let's see nearest value of 344 here 348 second is the nearest value so it is the correct answer i hope so you understood this question thank you for staying till the end of this video definitely for your success all the credit goes to your hard work but if my video will help for your success then i will consider myself lucky thank you once again take care bye bye